Do you have trouble controlling your anger? Do you wish there was a simple way to stop losing your temper at those that you love? If so, this video is for you. As an anger management expert, I have seen firsthand how destructive, uncontrolled anger can be in people's lives. However, I have also seen how powerful it is when you learn to control your anger effectively. In this video, I will be sharing with you three essential keys to controlling your anger. By incorporating these essential anger management keys into your life, you can learn to control your anger and live a calmer, more peaceful and fulfilling life. So let's dive into the three keys to anger management. Hello and welcome to the Anger Secrets YouTube channel. I'm Alistair Dews, and over the last 30 years, I've taught over 10,000 men and women how to control their anger, master their emotions, and create calmer, happier, and more respectful relationships. On this channel, I'll share the same proven tools and techniques I've used to help my clients control their anger and transform their lives. For free resources on how to control your anger, master your emotions, and create calmer, happier, and more respectful relationships, as well as the opportunity to book a free 20-minute anger assessment call with me, click the links in the description below or visit my website, angersecrets.com. I look forward to helping you on your anger management journey. So, what are the three keys to anger management? The first key is awareness. What do I mean by this? Simply put, to control your anger in any situation, you must first be aware that you are getting angry. This means being able to recognize when you're feeling angry and being able to de-escalate your anger before you say or do anything you'll regret. Let's use the following situation as an example. Imagine you're talking to your partner about something important to you and they're not listening. They're looking at their phone or they're looking around the room or they're just not engaged in the conversation. How would you feel at this moment? Chances are you would feel angry. Now imagine that the situation starts to escalate. Perhaps your partner says something that hurts your feelings or starts to argue with you. Many people in this situation would lash out in anger. Perhaps they start yelling or saying hurtful things to their partner. Suddenly the situation spirals out of control and now it's a full-blown argument. How can you avoid the situation? The key is to be aware of your anger before it escalates. If you catch yourself feeling angry early on, you can take steps to prevent the situation from escalating. In later videos, I will share with you some simple tools and techniques you can use to do this. For now, remember that the first key to anger management is awareness. If you are not aware that you are getting angry in a situation, there is nothing you can do to change how you are acting. However, if you are aware that you are getting angry in a situation, there are many things you can do to change how you are acting. I will talk more about this important principle in later videos. The second key to anger management is understanding that anger just does not help. What does this mean? Again, this is simple. No matter what situation you are in, or what other people are saying or doing to you, anger will never help you resolve the situation. In fact, anger will only make things worse. The realization that anger just does not help is a powerful realization for many people I work with. In fact, after teaching over 10,000 men and women how to control their anger over the last 30 years, no one has ever come to me and said, you know what, Alistair, I think my anger helps me in this situation. It is always the opposite. People come to me and say things like, I blew up at my boss and now I'm in danger of losing my job. Or I got into a screaming match with my partner and now our relationship is in trouble. Or I got so angry with my child that they are now scared of me. In every case, the person realizes that their anger was not helpful in the situation and that it just makes things worse. Therefore, the second key to anger management is to realize that no matter what situation you are in, responding with anger does not help. It will never help you achieve your goals and it will only make things worse. It does not matter whether your anger is directed towards your partner, your family, your work colleagues, or anyone else in your life. There are always better ways to respond to others 
and ways that help both you and the other person get what you want. Again, I will share what these ways are in future videos. The third and final key to anger management is that you create your anger. This may sound like a strange thing to say, but it's true. You see, anger is not something that just happens to you. It's not like being hit by a car or catching a cold. These things are things that just happen to you and you have no control over them. Anger is different. Anger is something that you create. It's not something that other people make you feel or something that just happens to you. I know this can be a challenging statement for many people, so let's look at an example. Imagine you are driving in traffic and suddenly another car cuts in front of you. For many people, this would lead to them feeling angry. They may start to feel their heart rate increase, their muscles tense up, and they may even start to shout at the other driver, perhaps honking their horn or gesturing angrily. Other people, however, in the same situation would remain calm. They may slow down, let the other driver in and just get on with their day with hardly a second thought about the situation. Now, what is the difference between these two groups of people? Both groups have the same situation happened to them. They were driving in traffic and another car cut in front of them. The difference between these two groups is not the events that happened to them, but what these groups of people thought about the situation. The first group, for instance, who became angry probably had thoughts such as, what an idiot, or they have no right to cut me off like that. The second group, on the other hand, who remained calm, probably had thoughts such as, I'm in no hurry, I can afford to be patient today, or I'm just going to let them in, it's not worth getting worked up about. Do you see how the thoughts that these two groups of people had about the event determined whether they got angry or not? The first group of people thought about the event in a way that made them angry, while the second group thought about it in a way that kept them calm. In other words, it's not the events that happen to you that create your anger, it is your thoughts about the events that happen to you that create your anger. This is a powerful statement and it can take some time to get your head around it, but it is one of the most important keys to anger management. When you understand that you create your anger, you have the power to change it. You can choose how you want to react to the events that happen to you, and you can choose thoughts that will keep you calm instead of thoughts that make you angry. In future videos, I will share more about how you can do this. For now, just remember that you create your anger, and that means you have the power to change it. Okay, we're just about finished for today, so let me summarize the three essential keys to anger management. These keys are, Key number one, awareness. Key number two, anger just does not help. And key number three, you create your anger. In future videos, I will explore each of these keys in more depth so that you can start to put them into practice and manage your anger more effectively. For now, just remember these three keys and that you have the power to change your anger. Okay, thanks for listening to today's video on the three essential keys to anger management and be sure to watch my next video on how to recognize your anger triggers. If you found this video helpful, please like this video and click the subscribe button below. This will help other people struggling with anger find and benefit from this channel. Remember, for free resources on how to control your anger, master your emotions, and create calmer, happier, and more respectful relationships, click on the links below or visit my website, angersecrets.com. And finally, remember, you can't control what other people do, but you can control how you react to them. Thank you for watching this video. I look forward to helping you on your anger management journey. Take care. The Anger Secrets YouTube channel is intended for information and educational purposes only. It is not a substitute for professional medical advice, diagnosis, or treatment. No medical or therapeutic relationship is implied or created by this video. If you have mental health concerns of any type, please seek out the help of a local mental health professional.